the medicines of the ancient Greeks that were found in an ancient shipwreck. The contents of pills made by doctors in ancient Greece were deciphered by American archaeologists. The drugs were found in glass containers in the wreck of a Greek ship discovered in 1989 off Tuscany in Italy. The ship from Walnut uh, uh, Wood, which sank in 130 BC, transported glassware from Syria and medicines which had remained intact from the water as they were protected by glass containers. After 20 years of research, the researchers were able to analyze the preparations, finding that each pill was a mixture of at least 10 different plant extracts, such as hibiscus and celery, which were used to treat patients in ancient Greece. Quote, for the first time, we now have the physical evidence contained in the writings of the ancient Greek physicians Dioscurides and Galen, said uh, Alan Twain of the Smithsonian Institute's National Museum of Natural History in Washington, according to the New Scientist magazine. Traces of carrot, radish, celery, wild onion, oak, cabbage, tame clover, that's alfalfa, and chilies, as well as hibiscus, which may have been imported from East Asia, India, or Ethiopia, were found in the pills. Pedanius Dioscurides, a physician and herbalist, forerunner of pharmacists in the first century AD, describes in his texts the carrot as a panacea for many health problems, considering, for example, that if one has eaten it in advance, one does not harm reptiles, while also helping to conceive a child. The analysis of ancient preparations and pills, in addition to new information, has created new mysteries for archaeobotanologists. The DNA study shows that the pills probably also contained sunflowers, a plant that scientists until now believe did not exist in the old world before Europeans discovered it in America. If the finding is confirmed, botanists will have to review the plant's traditional history and global distribution, to why yet said, although the possibility of sunflower and ancient pills still stems from a recent genetic infection. In fact, scientists hope that they will be able to decipher the exact measurements made by the ancient Greek doctors to prepare their medicines, optimistic that this may open new avenues in pharmacological research. I've translated this for you from a Greek article. Please leave your comments and thank you for your support. Finally support my Patreon account. The daily posts are five videos daily and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box below.